Hey, what's up everybody? Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video. So, some people were asking me, how much gas do I have to spend every day to make good at respect points, and how much live racing do I have to do and stuff like that? I actually made a chart a while back. I don't know how well you can see this, but this shows you exactly what you need to do to make around 700,000 plus respect points and we're going to come back that to that in just a minute we're going to go out to the map on the game and see what's on the map today okay so today we have a crew cup this is simply three races okay look at the rewards big chunks of respect points 14,400 respect points 28,800 respect points and 43,200 respect points that's a lot of respect points, and that's only three races. So right there, three things of gas, and you just earned a large amount of respect points. Now, you do have to belong to a crew in order to collect this, okay? So if you're not in a crew, you're not going to be able to do this. Today, we also have a supply cup, all right? That's going to be 25 races, plus the three races for the other thing. So that's 28 things of gas. That's still not too bad, okay? And that's not too bad. That's 28 races. What else is on the map today? Let's find out. We're going to do a daily battle. There's 29 races. And I'm going to look around. I got this service trial. What's on here? Well, I don't actually need to race this. I can do this if I want to. But that's an additional 15 races. That's not going to earn you much respect points. That's just going to earn you mainly some parts. We're just talking about... How many races do you need to do for respect points? And that's about the only thing I see. I'm going to do a couple daily battles. I'm going to do this crew cup. I'm going to do the supply cup. And then pretty much the rest of the day, I'm just going to do live racing. My goal is to win 15 live races a day. On a good day, maybe 30. All right. So 15 live race wins with a car that gives you 1,000 respect points per win is about 15,000 respect points. Okay, if you have a car that earns around 12 or 1300 respect points per win on live racing, you're going to get like, I don't know, 18 or 19,000 respect points just from doing 15 live racing wins. All right, so let's go back to the chart. Okay, so back to the chart. The first and the second day of the season, there's not a lot of stuff on the map that's giving out respect points. So on the first couple of days, all you have to do is win 15 to 30 live races. And that's going to give you somewhere around, I mean, if you can win 15 live races per day, that's going to give you around 273,000 respect points right there for the entire season. If you can win 30 live races per day, that's going to give you around 546 thousand respect points per day that's if you're using a car that gets 1000 to 1300 respect points per win hopefully that makes sense but sunday which is the third day of the season we have a supply cup that's 25 races and we have a token cup that's another three races so 25 28 races so that's 28 things of gas plus your 15 live racing wins so I don't know how much how much gas it's going to take you to get 15 live racing wins. Tuesday, the fifth day of the season, we have a crew cup. That gives out 86,400 respect points, and that's only three races. So Tuesday. So yes, I actually have a link to this. I will put a link to this chart in this video's description. That way you guys can actually pull this chart up and see it in full size and all that. So it's not right here on the computer. Now I've asked, also used, I just went onto the chart and I edited it. Now it tells you exactly how much gas you have to use for each day. For example, it says event gas on the first day. All right, 28 gas used. Then I also added... A second section for live racing gas and I put 15 plus because you want to make sure you win 15 live races a day if you want to break the million so if you can do all of this plus 15 live races a day you should be able to break a million respect points pretty easily I don't know how many gas it's going to actually take you to win 15 live races it might take 15 it might take 20 it might take 30 it all depends on the day all right and that's this is just for the days that are on here there's some days that aren't even on this chart because there's no like real events that day all right so the live racing gas 
you guys get the idea. Hopefully this makes sense. Hopefully this wasn't complicated or anything. So I think that pretty much wraps it up. But this shows you pretty much a rough draft of how much gas you have to day use a day. For example, this starts on the third day of the season. For the first day and the second day, there's no real events that you need to do except for live racing. So you could just live race the first two days. Let's just say you did a... Uh, you know, let's just say you won 15 live races the first two days. Well, you didn't have to spend any other gas if you didn't want to. Now, there are some little events that give out parts and some events that give out cash and stuff. I skip a lot of those. Why? Because I've been playing this game for a long time. And I get kind of lazy and I get kind of burned out if I spend too much time on the game. There's also showdowns, right? Showdowns add, showdowns add respect points. So, I mean, it depends on how many you do, but... This is just what it takes to hit around a million respect points per season. Like I said, just what's on this chart alone, forget about the live racing. Just doing the events on this chart by itself is going to get you over 700,000 respect points. So you don't even have to live race. But you do want to make sure you're winning at least your 15 live races a day because every time you win 15 live races, that gives you silver keys, okay? 10 times 14. Let's see, what is that? I'm not even sure. Let's find out how many silver keys you're getting just by doing. There's about there's about 14 days in the season times 10. So you're going to get around 130 to 150 keys, silver keys per season just from doing 10 live live racing wins. So that's almost three pools plus all the other stuff on the game that gives out keys. Usually you get around between five and 600 keys per season, at least for the silvers, okay? Um, bottom line, hopefully this video makes sense. Hopefully it's not complicated, but there's going to be a link to this chart in this video's description. That should make it even easier to understand if, you, if I made this too complicated or anything. Anyways, I think that pretty much wraps this up, and I will catch you guys later. Please like, subscribe, and hit the little bell notification that reminds you every time I make a new video. Alrighty? See ya.